the top 10 most venomous spiders. Number 10, Chinese bird spider. The Chinese bird spider is a large spider that feeds on cockroaches and small rodents. It is found in China and Vietnam. The venom of a Chinese bird spider contains neurotoxins, which causes temporary immobility and sometimes even permanent nerve damage. Number 9. Yellow Sack Spider This quarter to half inch spider that leaves sacks instead of webs. They spend long, silky sacks for their young. The yellow sack spider eats anything it can, including small rodents and even its own young. The venom of a yellow sack spider can cause tissue damage and can cause necrosis. Number 8. Fringed Ornamental Tarantula A fringed ornamental tarantula can grow to over 10 inches in length when it's stretched out. It is dark in color and found in the forests of India. It catches its prey without the use of its web. It's very, very quick. The toxin from this spider can cause a person to fall into a coma. Number 7. Hobo Spider The hobo spider is an extremely common spider found in all parts of the world. It is poisonous, but not nearly as poisonous as the others on this list. It finds its way to the number seven spot due to the chances of being bit by the hobo spider is greater than any other spider as it's so common. Number six, Sydney funnel web. Since the anti-venom for the Sydney funnel web was introduced in 1981, there have been no deaths attributed to the Sydney funnel web spider. It is a vicious, fearless spider that will attack its victims instead of trying to hide. The spider will hold on tightly to its victim and plunge its razor-sharp fangs into the skin, injecting the potent neurotoxin poison. It can grow up to three inches in length. Number five, six-eyed sand spider. The sand spider crawls its way to the number five position. It is called a sand spider due to its ability to camouflage itself in the desert. It will bury itself in the sand and wait for its prey. The venom of a sand spider can kill a small deer within a few hours. Number four, the Chilean recluse. A recluse can live for six months without food or water. It also has one less pair of eyes than you need. It has a pair of very sharp fangs that deliver a voracious bite. The wound will expand and turn a deep red. Anti-venom doesn't always help with this bite and people have been killed. Number three, the brown widow. The brown widow spider is recognized by red dots located on the spider's stomach. It's a fast and aggressive spider. The males are always smaller than the females. The brown widow is located in tropical climates. Number two, the black widow. The black widow is easily identified by a red oblong shape on its stomach. It is fast and aggressive. There were many deaths documented prior to the introduction of the antivenom. They are found all over the world, but they especially thrive in warmer climates. Number one, the number one most venomous spider in the world is the Brazilian wandering spider. It is very large when it spreads out, it's approximately seven inches and very aggressive. It will strike its victim many times in a row. Luckily, an anti-venom does exist. However, every year, this spider will cause a few fatal attacks in mostly the elderly and children. Time for the question of the day. If you were to be bitten by something, would you prefer it was a spider or a snake? Let us know in the comments sections below. And as usual, thanks for watching. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and click that subscribe button to see more awesome top 10 clips. We come out with top 10 videos just for you every week. Yes, you. Be sure to give this clip a thumbs up and go ahead and check out one of our other top 10 videos you see on the screen now.